I have a Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 3 here. I'm going to show you how to set it up step by step. Take note that after I'm done the setup, I'll make another video on how to insert the SIM card and the link will be below, okay? So from the welcome screen here, I mean, we can go ahead and go from here or you can go ahead and do it this way as well, but I'm going to go ahead and just go like this. So from here, go ahead and choose your language. I'm going to go with English here, tap on starts, a few legal items to review. Now you will need to check at least the first two to proceed, okay? The last one here, sending diagnostic data, that's optional, but for me, I'm fine with checking all three of these. And I'll go ahead and tap on next. Now I'm gonna go ahead and connect to my home Wi-Fi network so I can get the latest update right now. So my home Wi-Fi network, let me put in my password. Put in my password, let me tap on connect here. It's connected, let's tap on next. Getting your phone ready. This may take a few minutes. Okay, there we go. So copy apps and data. You can choose to transfer your apps, photos, contacts, Google account, and more. If you want to proceed like that, tap on next. For me, I want a clean slate here, so I'm going to click on don't copy for me. From here, you can put your Google account in, which is basically your Gmail, or you can go ahead and create one. For me, I'm going to skip it. I'll go ahead and add my Gmail account later. So I'll tap on skip here as well. Google services, now all three of these are optional. You can have these checked or not checked, it's up to you. For me, I'm fine with all of these. And I'm gonna tap on accept. Protect your phone, you can go ahead and put a password in. And uh, you can skip this, but I would advise, put some kind of password in right now at least. I'm gonna go with the pin right now. It's a four digit. After you put in your four digit, tap on continue. You have to um, type it in again. Then tap on OK right there. Samsung account, you can go ahead and sign into your Samsung account or you can create an account. For me, I'm going to skip it. I can always sign in later on as well. I'll skip down here as well. Taking care of your phone, you can read through that. Tap on Next. And we're done. You can tap on Finish or you can go ahead and explore your Galaxy Z from here. Okay, so for me, I mean, I'm done right here. And voila. We are in business, all right? Pretty simple. Any questions or issues, just comment below. Good luck.